This video illustrates a unique gas mixing system invented in the UK by James Murcott. The system uses very little energy, approximately 1 watt per cubic meter, and it has the unique advantage of incorporating an automatic degritting system, so that very gritty substrates such as slurry from cows bedded on sand and ash, or unwashed potatoes or sugar beet, can be put directly into the digester without any pre-processing such as washing or grit settling. The digester shown is 1100 cubic meters. It is fed with cattle slurry and chicken muck and produces 160 kilowatts of electricity. Here we see the digester mixing and degritting arm. It moves very slowly, so slowly that the digester is minimally mixed, allowing the natural sulfur eating bacteria to grow. These are vital in order to effectively scrub the biogas to levels low enough to ensure effective running of the CHP. These bacteria make a white film on the surface of the digester. All the sequences here have been speeded up as the whole point of this type of mixing is to minimally mix in order to let the material stratify into digested and undigested layers so the colonies of bacteria can work on the undigested material and the highly digested liquid layer can be pulled out. Thus, there is no need for plug flow or high energy use excessive mixing. As the mixing comes through this portion of the digester, the floating layer is mixed and becomes very liquid. The powerful action of the gas bubbles can be seen in the way the substrate mixes one way, then the next. In this sequence, the whole surface of this portion of the digester starts to heave and souffle ahead of the gas mixing. The mixing comes through and the huge number of gas bubbles can be seen. These are from both the gas mixing and from the incredibly active bacteria in this layer. As the mixing passes, the layer reforms and then the speeded up mixing comes through again. The gas bubbles can clearly be seen, both as small bubbles and as the occasional large one. And this is what comes out of the system. In addition to a wonderful liquid feed, a very fine, well-digested fiber is produced, perfect for helping soil microbes and helping to retain water on crops and gardens.